Justin and Hailey Bieber have sparked concern after Hailey's dad, Stephen Baldwin, asked for prayers for the couple. Can you confirm that you're still happily married? Justin, There's here's a lot that of rumors. Movie party, party. Okay. All hail breaks loose. Hailey Bieber basically confirmed. <laughs> Confirmed split from Justin. Fans insist a star addresses divorce rumors in late night posts. Is Justin and Hailey Bieber's marriage in serious trouble? Well, that seems to be worrying a lot of fans after Hailey's dad's recent post. And it's not just that. We all know that Justin and Hailey aren't very talkative in public, but their body language with each other when they're out and about has got people panicking. Hailey didn't even include Justin in her Valentine's dump on IG. Now, reportedly, Hailey is fearful at her dad for posting about her and Justin's personal business. Could the couple really be calling it quits? I got all the tea, so let's find out. Stephen Baldwin will be the reason why Hailey Bieber and Justin Bieber get divorced. And it's not because of those pray for them comments. It's because he manufactured this whole marriage in the first place. Now, divorce rumors between Hailey and Justin are nothing new. I mean, it seems like every couple of months, some new headline pops up about their relationship ending or them not being happy. However, this this new wave of rumors seems to be really strong and fans are really freaking out because Haley's own father is the one who inadvertently started them. So Justin and Haley were attending church in Beverly Hills and all seemed normal. I mean, Justin's body language was a bit off considering the way he was hiding his face from the paparazzi, but that's nothing new with Justin. He could have just been having one of those days. One paparazzi even asked the couple while they were leaving church if they were still happily married. Anyways, the drama seemed to begin way before for the service. Justin and Haley's pastor, Victor Marx, took to Instagram to post a now deleted post of Justin singing. But that's not shocking. Justin is a singer, of course. His pastor posting a video of him singing is totally normal. What isn't normal is the caption that Victor added to the video. It read, Christians, please, when you think of Justin and Haley, take a moment to offer a little prayer for them to have wisdom, protection, and to draw close to the Lord. Now, the post didn't go viral right away. But but that all changed when Haley's dad saw the post and decided to repost it on his own IG stories. Loves that simple repost took the internet by storm. People everywhere started speculating that things between Haley and Justin were seriously on the rocks. And for a father to post such a thing regarding his daughter and his son-in-law, he must have been seriously concerned for them. In the mere hours, the story had spread to every corner of the internet. Naturally, after people saw that, what Haley's dad had posted was was a repost, they clicked to see the original post, and that's when the rumors got even stronger. Loves in the original post from Justin and Haley's pastor, Victor, he had added another caption that said, I seldom like to post about certain folks in the limelight because of the negative comments we get. Eileen and Haley's mom often pray together for Justin and Haley and our children as well. There are special challenges that folks in high visibility positions face. Also, the enemy doesn't want them to draw closer to Jesus. So often, regardless of the material things or accolades, they face spiritual warfare that intense and seek to shipwreck their faith, marriage, and life in general. So thank you. Y'all, let's be honest. If you were shipping Justin and Haley's relationship, wouldn't you be panicking after reading that? Well, most people did, and it was just chaos. Some were refusing to believe the rumors, while others were just outright starting crazy rumors. Just take a look at these people's reactions. Honestly, I don't think she will ever leave him. She's always wanted Justin. In. If they were to separate, I think he'd have to be the one to call it quits. Haley is never leaving Justin Bieber. She has always been an obsessed fangirl of his, so much so that she would stalk him at his hotels. Now that she's got him, she's never letting go of that man. She would never divorce him. She did too much work to have him, and I think he became dependent of her business-wise, so he wouldn't either. Haley and her family are drugging Justin Bieber so he looks insane, so they can put him on conservatorship and live off his money. Save Justin before they do him like Britney Spears. Then I saw that Hailey Bieber no longer follows her, her, not her husband, her father, Stephen Baldwin. And I was like, I love me. I was like, okay, first of all, did she ever follow him? And second of all, did she unfollow him because of all the drama that happened yesterday? Anyways, with all this attention on their relationship, people wanted to now see Haley and Justin's reaction to the serious rumors. But before they could even issue a statement, a source close to the couple told TMZ that Haley was not happy with her dad at all all for reposting that IG story. The source said that even though Haley's dad had pure intention 
intentions for Haley and Justin, Haley was extremely pissed off at her dad. However, the source claimed that Haley's dad didn't just repost that story out of nowhere. In fact, he reposted it because of something specific that the couple was privately going through. The source didn't say what the thing was, but from the tone used, it was definitely something very serious. And after hearing Haley is furious at her dad, I think it is safe to say that it is a sensitive issue. Haley Bieber posted this meme to her Instagram story that reads, no worries either way when I'm actually worried both ways plus a secret third way. And she added, wow, I feel seen. And a lot of fans are thinking that perhaps this relates to her marriage to Justin Bieber and she's worried about something with him. Especially since that Instagram story post follows this main feed gallery post captioned just girly things. And if you swipe through, the last slide has this text message that it looks like Haley sent that said he is inconsequential to my existence. A lot of fans think this is referring to her husband, Justin, while others think it's simply a real Housewives of Potomac reference. Now that in and of itself didn't really do anything to calm the divorce rumors and neither does Haley's dad after he decided to take to Instagram again to post a very bizarre video vaguely addressing the drama he low-key began. All kinds of competition, war, and gamesmanship usually includes some kind of deception. Now, clearly, throughout our culture and society, we see deception. Now, the provocateurs of such are very nervous, hmm, only because they do not know that peace beyond our understanding. anyone can tell me what he was talking about in that video, I would really appreciate it because I could hear and understand the words, but I just couldn't comprehend what he was saying. I mean, after the reports that his daughter was angry at him came out, you would expect that he would come out with an apology or something, but he came out with that. I don't even know what to call it. I doubt he even knows what to call it. Anyways, amidst all these divorce rumors, Justin celebrated his birthday. People were curious to see what would happen because just weeks before on Valentine's, Haley didn't post Justin like at all in her Valentine's dump. But Haley surprised everyone. She posted a series of videos and pics with the caption 30. That was fast. Words could never truly describe the beauty of who you are. Happy birthday to you. Love of my life for life. Loves, it looks like Haley wasn't beaten around the bush this time. She was making it clear that she and Justin were perfectly happy. And if that wasn't clear enough, she later posted this IG story saying, just FYI, the stories and the constant blind items I see on TikTok are 100% of the time wrong. Made out of thin air. Come from the land of delusion. So I know it might be fun feeding into these stories, but just so you know, they're always false. XX, sorry to spoil it. No, you would think that Haley's post would be the end of the story, but you would be extremely wrong. In one of the pics Haley posted on Justin's birthday, fans were quick to notice that Justin wasn't wearing his wedding ring. Y'all, the speculation started back up again with many people questioning why Justin wasn't wearing his ring anymore. And now speaking of Justin, people have been extremely worried about him in particular. Other than that birthday post, Haley hasn't posted Justin at all for a significant amount of time. And for celebrities who post a lot about their lives, that was concerning to some fans. On top of that, rumors of Justin being a bit down have been spreading as of late. So much so that Justin turned down an opportunity to perform with Usher at the Super Bowl halftime show because reportedly he didn't want to deal with all the eyeballs on him. Instead, he opted to sit in the audience with Haley. Not gonna lie, I'm no psychologist, but given his recent mood and the way he is constantly shying away from the limelight and on top of the reports that he and Haley are going through something, I think it wouldn't be that far off to say that from the outside, it seems like this is getting to him. On top of that, a source close to the couple talked to Us Weekly in early February this year and said that despite growing pains in their relationship, Justin and Haley were in a good place in their relationship now. The source added that their relationship was in a good place because of therapy and good communication. On the other hand, Haley and Justin haven't been shy about the struggles they have faced in the past in their marriage. Most notably, after the first year being married, Justin and Haley did an interview with Vogue and Haley said the thing is, 
is, marriage is very hard. That is the sentence you should lead with. It's really effing hard. The couple even opened up about having a couple of sessions with a marriage counselor. While doing his GQ interview, Justin talked about how his first year in marriage was a huge challenge for him. Justin said, the first year of marriage was really tough, he said, because there was a lot. Going back to the trauma stuff, there was just a lack of trust. There was all these things you don't want to admit to the person that you're with because it's scary. You don't want to scare them off by saying, I'm scared. By the way, did I mention that Justin had some reservations about proposing to Haley in the first place? Justin was struggling with the idea of committing and staying loyal to Haley, but he did some soul searching and decided that he wanted to be with Haley. So much so that Haley was his inspiration when he wrote Yummy. But being in the public eye has definitely not made their relationship easier. You guys, when Haley and Selena were in that beef a while back with all sorts of speculations coming out that apparently Haley started dating Justin while he was still with Selena, that then turned into the whole mean girl drama with Kylie getting involved and it just spiraled into a huge mess, leading to Haley getting threatened by people online. Eventually, after talking with Selena, she issued a statement saying, I want to thank Selena for speaking out as her and I have been discussing the last few weeks how to move past this ongoing narrative between her and I. The last few weeks have been very hard for everyone involved and millions of people are seeing so much hate around this, which is extremely harmful. While social media is an incredible way to connect and build the community, moments like this only create extreme division instead of bringing people together. Things can always be taken out of context or construed differently than they were intended. We all need to be more thoughtful about what we post and what we say, including myself. In the end, I believe love will always be bigger than hate and negativity, and there is always an opportunity to meet each other with more empathy and compassion. Tell me why Stephen Baldwin, Hailey Bieber's father, is following Selena Gomez? Best friend, what in the keeping up with the Kardashians is this? Why is Hailey Bieber's father following Selena Gomez? Now, all of these hurdles and challenges have led us here. Justin and Haley facing yet another divorce rumor. According to Haley, everything between them is pretty good. From Justin and Haley's own admission in the past, things are good but not perfect, but they have demonstrated that they are willing to work on it. As for why Justin wasn't wearing his wedding ring in the pic that Haley posted of him, that I don't know. But I am sure that all the speculations online are false because if he wasn't wearing his ring because his marriage was almost ending, why then would he be kissing his wife in the picture. I mean, it makes no sense. But amidst all the latest divorce rumors, we haven't really heard from Justin, but maybe it's because he will say the same thing as his wife? But what do y'all think? Is Justin and Haley's relationship in trouble? And what do you think of Haley's dad posting about their personal business online like that? Let me know in the comments below. Don't forget to check out my previous video to ensure you are up to date with the tea. Till next time, bye love!